Hey guys, Vegas Romania, guess what? The studio is getting built. There will be more and better content from now on. I got a new laptop, got my logo on the wall, and I got my t-shirt on. So only good things can happen from now on. Here's a quick preview that I posted on my other channel regarding this laptop. Three reasons you should never buy a gaming laptop. This is the Asus Tough and I hate it. I should feel privileged because this is the Risen 4800H, a laptop that is really really hard to find. This is the one with the 1660 Ti and I got it for a great price. So why I hate it? First reason, it's loud. All gaming laptops are. And I didn't know this. This is my first gaming laptop and I had no clue that they are so loud all the time. I thought that they would get hot after a while, but they are getting hot instantly. You move the mouse, it's hot. You open a browser, it's hot. Sounds like a hair dryer all the time and it drives me nuts. You know when you try to play your games and you try to listen for something crawling behind you? Yeah, you're not gonna hear that. All you're gonna hear is fan noise. Let me show you how loud it is. I'm going to use a meter, a sound meter. I know what you're gonna say. That's not fair because it's behind. Well, here it is, in front. So what you have to do is wear headphones all the time. Really Number two reason is that you don't get the same performance from a 1660 as you would get on a desktop. So just because the name is there and it says the 1660 Ti video card doesn't mean that it's as fast as a normal desktop. Usually you lose about 25% frame rate uh, just because you are on a mobile device and you're limited by the power output that the laptop is uh, rated for. So when you buy these laptops, 25% faster you'll have to buy another. The third reason is I lied. There is no third reason. These laptops are actually pretty good. This particular one with a 4800H um, Risen processor is absolutely fast. It's not as fast as a desktop, but it's super fast. Um, what I like about this laptop is that it's mobile and I could take it with me and I could do my video processing for you guys watching these videos uh, off a very, very good laptop. It does have some downsides. It is not a desktop. I got spoiled with a very, very powerful desktop with three monitors and all the goodies on it. And now when I'm here with a little mouse like this, uh, trying to do video editing and using the keyboard on the laptop, I feel the fact that I just don't have the same comfort. But at the same time, I could do it on the fly. And that's the reason that you buy these laptops. If you absolutely need to be on the go, you want to play games while you're like sitting in a hotel or you're traveling or something like that this laptop will do it but if you are buying this laptop to replace your desktop computer at home you're making a big mistake thanks for watching uh, let me know what you think at the bottom of this video um, maybe i'm wrong and i would like to hear about it as i said in the video it's not the best thing in the world but it will do it's a really really nice laptop I'm just so spoiled with a very very good desktop now it's time to start editing some videos and making some videos for you guys. Also I'm going to have a very very good video coming soon as far as how I uh, am making steps to fix my lower back that it's really really bad. So stay tuned for that one and thanks for watching.